The establishment of the Hayes office fended off outside interference in the movie business, but even as they declared their dedication to high morality and family values, the moguls found ways to profit from audience tastes for the risque. Filmmakers found the way to do that was to give their audiences a lot of sex, a lot of fun, a lot of partying, a lot of drinking in a Prohibition era, and then at the end, to have the good girl marry the good boy and live happily ever after in a, in a nice little chaste life. Cecil B. DeMille did this with his Sin and Salvation epics, where he could show a lot of sinning, a lot of sex, a lot of debauchery. Because at the end, there was salvation for all concerned. <laughs>